Hey everyone, Andrew here with ACR Protect. Thanks for stopping by. Today I wanted to bring you a video on the Tacticon Battle Vest V2 plate carrier I just picked up before the holidays. Kind of getting back on track with the, uh, the ACR Protect motto of just trying to get back to protection. Uh, and armor is one of those things. I uh, want to start the video with, with wearing it so you can kind of see. We're going to set it down and take it off, put it on the tabletop, and, and uh, go into it a little bit more, give you some specs. That's not typically what I do. Um, but, uh, you know, those that are getting into this, I want to give you as much knowledge as possible because um, I'm still kind of learning on these as well. Uh, but first, let's get ourselves a beverage <clears throat> today. We're gonna do a St. Arnold's lawnmower. It's a uh, kind of a summer staple around here. I'm not gonna do a glass. We're just gonna drink it out of the can. It's a uh, Kolsch style beer. Very easy going. So beautiful day out here. It's about uh, almost 80 degrees. And uh, so cheers. And like I said, easy going. About 4.9. So I'm gonna take this heavy thing off because we're gonna get into the weight on it and everything and um, put it on the table and kind of go over some stuff. And so stand by. All right, we're back. So like I said, this is from Tacticon Armament. It is the Battle Vest V2 and it comes with two AR500 plates. The plates, um, are 10 by 12 and they're eight pounds each um, the price when I right before posting this video uh, for the setup with the the carrier and the plates it's 150 bucks the carriers come in a multitude of colors tan black OD green uh, multicam I think there's like a multicam black a lot of stuff Unfortunately, when I checked uh, just a little bit ago, it was out of stock. Um, but it's been in and out of stock since they've they've put it out. <clears throat> I just happened to catch it right before the holidays, um, and and with the price of 150, kind of getting into this, uh, I thought that was a pretty good deal. The plates themselves are uh, level three plus, um, which stops. 5.56 green tip, 5.56 FMJ, 7.62 by, uh, by 39, 308, and 762 uh, by 54R. So it stops a lot. They're not level four. So if you want to beat me up in the comments, go ahead. Um, but one, it's kind of been tough to find the level four plates, even more so finding them at a good price. Um, in a moment, I'm going to take this apart so you can kind of see what the, what the plates look like. Um, but the, uh, it does have kind of this webbing, uh, cummerbund, um, which some people like, some people don't. Some people want the, the, the one that's just all the way, the full material all the way straight across. Um, you can add more stuff to it. This still does have the Molly, uh, on there. As you can see, I've added a quick release <clears throat> uh, system to this, and I'm going to try to put that in the description. I think it's uh, Libyans or something like that. I got it on Amazon. Couldn't even tell you uh, how much it was because I, I, I got it actually by accident like a year ago. But uh, the way those work is once you put it on, you just... And so I just leave it like that. I just leave one side undone so I can slide it on and off a little bit faster um, and go from there. Uh, the cover bun is adjustable from 38 inches to 48 inches. So, you know, a multitude of, uh, of sizes of folks. Um, I have set this up kind of basic right now. Um, it's, uh, I wasn't quite sure what I was gonna do with this. <clears throat> uh, you know, I have a lot of the, uh, chest rigs and so this is the armor is kind of new for me I, I i do have some regular uh soft body armor uh that i've that i've worn for 
for different jobs in the past, um, but the plate armor was was a little bit different for me, and so I didn't want to go go too uh, too in depth on on buying something super expensive. Just wanted to try it out. I I actually would like to buy another set of plates uh, to take to the range and try them out because um, I'm kind of a believer in and testing some stuff out before you you put it into use. Uh, either way safe to say you don't want to be you don't want to be hit while while wearing this i mean it is going to provide a level of protection but it's still going to suck um as we i'm going to move my beer because this card table is a little a little soft and uh it, it's this this plate carrier is weighing as is right now 21 and a half pounds um that's that's the carrier the plates i have three loaded ar mags in there 30 round mags um, so it's a little bit of weight. Um, you, you notice it, uh, that that's for sure. Um, the, the, the device itself, the carrier itself actually just has an admin pocket. They say that it accommodates three mags and they put, um, the little tabs, like what's on this insert, which I'm going to talk about here in a second on there. Um, I was not a fan uh, because the mags kind of slipped around. I wanted something a little more fixed. And so I bought this Condor insert that basically just goes right in here. And I, and I get what Tacticon's trying to do. They're, they're trying to make it uh, a little more versatile. So if you wanted it as an admin pouch, you could do that or you could do mags. Um, but I, I, I am a fan of having the dividers. It just makes the, the mags to go in and out a little bit easier. Um, which is why I bought the insert. There's still a Molly field that you can put on the on the front here if you want to add some stuff. Um, I am not wanting to do that at this time. I'm trying to kind of keep it slick and basic. Uh, like I said, I'm not 100% sure uh, how I'm going to set this up in completion, but I think right now I want to keep it pretty basic. Uh, it does come with this little uh, Velcro uh, flag patch on there. I just kept that on there so you could see, see what's what. Um, I'm going to flip it around so you can see the back here. Knocking shit everywhere. My bad, y'all. <clears throat> okay. So you can see how it's adjusted on the back here, just with some shock cord, and you can bring it in or out as needed. Um, has a little grab handle that, that does Velcro down, which I do like. It kind of keeps it from hanging up on stuff. Um, has the Molly panel across the back. If you want to add um, hydration bladder or uh, some type of uh, additional pack, <clears throat> they have some different packs that uh, that are made to to go on here. In fact, Tacticon actually has one that you take the straps off and it just uh, attaches right to it. So if you want to go that way, if you want to have another another kit set up with that, uh, you can do that. Again, my concept with this right now, um, I'm keeping it as just like an active shooter rig. Um, cause if you're putting on plates, if you're putting on armor, uh, to me, you're, you're expected to see some trouble. Uh, you're, you're looking to possibly have rounds come your way and, and you do want as much protection as possible. Uh, so I do see a place in having these. Um, I also wanted to make sure I got a, I got a set cause there's, there's been some chatter, um, about not being able to pick up armor, uh, down the road. Uh, not exactly sure how true that is, but uh, wanted to get some beforehand. Um, and at this price, I might be looking at uh, picking up a couple more sets uh, just just because it's a good price. So I'm going to slide this up a little bit. I'm going to take this back plate out so you can see it. So just Velcro's in there, has a little lip right there. And then it has, I'm not sure if you can see with my big ass hand in there, these little holding straps the Velcro in on the inside and boom there's your plate so you can see what it looks like right there it does have that coating on it um, it, could, it comes with that that wasn't any extra charge or anything um, but that's what that's what we're looking at that's the uh, that's the setup. It was, um, it shipped fairly quick. 
uh, I think they said five days shipping time. Um, of course, it was right around the holidays. Uh, it may have taken closer to uh, maybe eight to 10 days by the time I actually got it, um, which which is understandable, especially. Well, there you have it, folks. Some armor plate carrier for about 150 bucks. I think that's a pretty good deal. Check out their sites. Again, I bought this with my own money. It's not like uh, Tacticon sending me anything, but I do like their stuff. It's pretty good. I've, I've been pretty pleased with it. So if you're looking to get armor, uh, if that's something that you're you're wanting to dive into, uh, I think it's worth a look. There's a lot of there's a lot of stuff out there. Um, you know, different different plate carriers, different companies, and 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 different plates. But uh, this is the one I chose to go with, and so uh, we're going to give it a shot. Again, that's all I have uh, for this video. Thank you very much for, for checking it out and stopping by. And uh, until next time, take care.